Roy Murphy, to what do I owe the displeasure of your company? You know, Pope, it's because of guys like you that we've got exterminators. Murphy, I own this club now. You can't come strolling in here anytime you want. Now tell me what you do want so I can get on with having you thrown out. Pope, you better call off this ape if you know what's good for Who you. Who you calling an ape? Haven't you ever noticed that ugly gorilla who watches you shave every morning? It's a good thing you went for coffee or this might have been you. It's Lawrence Crumshaw. Or what's left of him. Where were you? Max sent me to get coffee. I mean, the way you guys go through it. You filthy pig. I have more champagne upstairs. I can do a lot for you, Roy. I've got wealth. So you're behind this. Oh yeah. I figured with a mouth like yours, a couple of minutes would be your limit with Pope. Well, is there anything I can do for you? Well, as a matter of fact, there is. It seems all you two think I'm good for is making coffee. Two. Black. Job outs. Oh, they got these great fish and chips there. And they got these meatball sandwiches. Those are the best meatball sandwiches ever. You shouldn't have run out when you did, Roy. I had more champagne chewing. Murphy, you made a big mistake coming in here today. One won't ever get a chance to repeat. Well, look what the cat dragged in. I was wondering when you were going to drop in again. You're looking good, Roy. You know, if I live to be a hundred, I'll never get dames like that. Brother, you can say that again. You know, this detective stuff ain't as glamorous as it seems. Tell me about it. Well. Got a bad feeling about this. Oh, come on, where's your sense of adventure? <laughs>